Yes. Huh? <laughs> Mandatory malpractice insurance in the state of Nevada? Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, state Bar of California studying whether to require professional liability insurance? Yes. Mm -hmm. um, personal injury, real estate, family law? Mm -hmm. Now, uh, the number of claims by area of law? Yes. In 2015? Yeah. <laughs> Um, collection, bankruptcy, family law, personal injury, and other, yes. Now, 89% of malpractice claims nationally are resolved for less than $100,000? Yeah. 95% of the claims are resolved for less than $250,000? <sighs> Could you get me the personal umbrella policies as well as the malpractice insurance? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> 11% of applications of the client protection fund were denied because they described incidents of malpractice other than theft or dishonest conduct. Yes. Well, WSBA, why don't you get me your client protection fund in each and every bar association of the United States? <laughs> I would say it's dishonest conduct. Yes. To use forgeries. Mm hmm to issue court orders, pooch. Now, I think there's an actual claim for all malpractice insurance as well as all of the actual funds of the client protection fund in each and every bar association in the United States of America. Now, for the idiot dicks that work right now in the WSBA, I have sent 2,700,000 emails. Yes. Every day, well, for probably the last month, month and a half, I've documented class action lawsuits. <laughs> and these individuals, they call themselves law enforcement, yes, have arrested me knowing I hadn't been involved in any crimes, yes. In fact, I had informed them that I wanted them to exonerate me of any wrongdoing. <laughs> but they continue, yes, mm -hmm. every day, yes, uh, the perpetration, yeah, mm hmm of the fraud, of issuing fraudulent court orders, yes, and uh, the furtherance of a current or planned crime or fraud, yeah. Now, the only thing that I could really, I could believe, yes, is somebody is planning to commit another crime, yes, either in the Port Angeles Police Department, yes, in the Squim Police Department, yeah, or the Sheriff's Department, somebody's planning to commit the crime of arresting me again, yes. Now, I've been arrested numerous times right now, mm -hmm. and for some reason, no one wants to enforce the laws. Mm -hmm. Now, I want to explain something to you. Oh, I went to the clothing bank yesterday, yes, and I got some new used shoes. Yep. Mm -hmm. The problem is they're size 11 wide, yes, uh -huh. and they're very, very stiff-soled, <laughs> But I have to break them in because I have no money and it's causing my feet an immense amount of pain. <laughs> and as I experience that pain, I realize how much I hate you right now. Now, I'm going to continue to experience the pain of not having the laws enforced. Yes, until you actually decide to do something. <laughs> because I don't have enough money to purchase my own shoes. <laughs> because those individuals that hate me, yes, refuse to enforce the laws and are planning to commit another crime. <laughs> now, I'm going to want the actual bar association number <laughs> of every attorney in every state of the United States. <laughs> because I will speak right now. I will continue to experience pain until these shoes have been broken in. <laughs> because every time I take a step, it reminds me of how much pain I feel.